Hi, we are at the Dubai Air Show 2015, where Stride Group, which specialized in armored vehicle, is showcasing three of its solutions. The Varan on my left, the Riot Control in my back, and the G36 6x6 on my right. The Varan is a 6x6 tactical armored vehicle with advanced ballistic and blast protection ensuring crew survivability in the modern-day battlefield. Varan can be used as a platoon strength troop carrier, eight dismounts and a commander and driver, and can also be configured as a command and control platform, forward observation vehicle or in convoy support role. Stanag 4569 level 4 armoring means Varan can protect against mine strikes and IEDs blast and can be fitted with ceramic or composite plates for even greater protection. With the option to make Varan amphibious and fitting the optional CBRA infiltration system, Varan is a truly multi-environment vehicle. The riot control vehicle is especially designed to provide a range of non-lethal options to disperse protesters in situations of civil unrest and violent protest. The vehicle is equipped with powerful, remotely operated, multi-directional water cannons and a water tank capacity of 6,000 liters. The water cannons are fitted with proportional valves and separate tanks to infuse dyes, foams and other additives. The riot control vehicle has been specifically designed to provide maximum safety for the vehicle's crew. The vehicle's smooth exterior prevents rioters from mounting it and each vehicle is also equipped with 360 degrees tear gas duct system. When used, the system will spread tear gas around the vehicle and quickly drive back any rioters to a safe distance. The riot controlled vehicle has excellent maneuverability and when used effectively, the vehicle will quickly disperse even the most unruly crowd without any fatal injuries. This is the G63 6x6. It is a limited production vehicle as only 200 were made and this is the only armored one. It has B7 level armoring by Stride Group. It features independent suspensions on all six wheels with run flat tires and central tire inflation system.